What is up you guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your very first time joining me. My name is Jessica. My mother is a makeup lover, of course. So for today's look, we are doing um, neon graphic liner. Those are the vibes. I don't know if you could see too well from where you're at. Um, I'm also playing with some new goodies. So you're going to definitely want to stay tuned until the face portion because we're having some fun today. I did not use the primal palette today. <gasps> Cue the gasps. <gasps> She's shocked. I did use a Blend Bunny palette though. I used the Blend Bunny Surge palette today um, because I, I needed those neons. You know what I mean? Um, so these are the vibes that we're going to be doing. I am going to be doing my full face makeup, which let me tell you, I look smooth. Okay. I look smooth. I think today's video is just going to be really fun and super simplistic. It's kind of more tedious than anything. Little tiny details, you know, stuff like that. Um, but... I'm very pleased with how everything came out, so definitely don't forget to stay tuned until the very end of my video where I do an up close of my eye look so that way you guys can see the true beauty of the blend. And if you're curious to see how I achieved this full face of makeup, then definitely keep on watching. So my eyelids are already primed. I just went in with my P. Louise base. And for today, I'm going to be taking the Blend Buddy Cosmetics Surge Palette because I am going to be doing um, some neon colors. So these are like the best neons that I have. Probably the only, ne might be the only neons that I have actually. I'm going to be doing like white graphic liners. So I'm going to start with a very simplistic, just smoky eye look. So I'm going to start by taking this shade right here, which is called Cut Out. And I'm just going to take this on a fluffy brush. And I'm going to smoke it out all over my whole lid. So just like that, you see that beautiful blush color all over the lid. I'm going to deepen it up a little bit, but I'm going to start. I, I don't want too much color on the eye. And then I'm going to take some of the shade grunge which is just this beautiful brown and i'm gonna take this um this is a jessup 227 Lux soft definer and i'm just gonna i'm gonna tap it in like this so the product's all on the top and then i'm just gonna start blending and smoking it out into that first shade and this will be the deepest color on the lid. But I didn't want it to be stark brown. I wanted it to be kind of lighter. So I'll just keep going back and forth in between these two colors. Until they're nice and smoked out. But I just want some sort of color on the lid. And then we can get to the fun stuff, which is going to be the graphic liner. Um, I'm going to be using two separate white products. So I'm going to start by taking the P. Louise Rewhite Base. And then I'm also going to be taking the Made by Mitchell Graphing Liner in the shade Milk. So first things first, I'm going to just take this little liner brush. And then I'll just take the Rewhite Base on the back of my hand. So this next, this kind of, it's going to be floaty type liner. This is actually inspired by, shit, what's her name? Hold on. Um... I did get it off of TikTok. Latina Beauty is her name. So it's essentially just kind of like floaty liner. So just like this, I'll, I'll show you, I'll show you. But this is by Latina Beauty on TikTok. If you do not follow her, she's, she's bad. She's a baddie. Mm. Okay, so this is the general idea, the line, but now I'm gonna take this kind of just small brush and I'm gonna go over and under anywhere that kind of got a little crazy before. I'm gonna be setting this with shadow, so I wanna make sure that my line is pretty precise so that way I'm not setting any mistakes in place, only perfection. So now I'm going to be taking the whole bottom row in the exact order that it's in. And then um, if once I hit the green, I'll go back to the beginning. So we're just going to be taking shocked, 
I'll, I'll tell you guys the names. I'll tell you the names so that way when I'm going through them, you'll remember. Shocked. Power. Charged. Pulse. Energy. Chemistry. Yeah, chemistry. So, yeah. So I'll just tap these right over that white line and then um, I'll dust under like I'll dust under that line and everything if the shadow gets like too crazy but I'm just gonna just essentially take this really tiny brush and just tap the pigment down. Okay, so now I'm going to take this white made by Mitchell liner and I'm going to go right in the center of all these colors. Okay, and then I'll just go... Um, I'll just go around with a tiny little detail brush. Ouch. Hold on, okay? And just kind of make sure this line is really nice and tight. Okay, I'm pretty excited for like the face makeup. Um, you hear my kid right here? He's, he's watching Mickey Mouse Clubhouse and he gets hype. Okay, my son gets fucking hype over it. So, look what came in the mail. The Michaela Pot 2 Glam Light. So I didn't buy the palette, but I did buy the highlighter. So I wanted to um, use this in today's video. So when we get to that portion, I'll swatch these for you guys. Um, but 10 out of 10 on the packaging with the little with the little doo doo doo. Look at that. Ah! And it has a little mirror in it. This is so cute. I wasn't like too overly excited about the eyeshadow palette, but I was really, really excited for the highlighter because you guys know me. I love highlighter. So we're going to be using this today. Um, so let's slap the rest of my face on. Um, so first things first, I'm trying to use this up. This is the Milani Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation. This bitch has lasted me like, like a long, long time. But I do like it, so we're trying to use her up still. I kind of always rotate through my foundations, so it's really hard for me to use one up. Like, quickly, you know? So we're just taking the sponge and we're just sponging her in. Oh, I spit a little when I said that. Gross. Looking good. She's looking good. Okay. Um, Too Faced Shade Golden. You know. Press it down with my sponge. Same mold, same mold. Well, let's move on. So for blush, I'm going to be taking, well, for cream blush, I'm going to be taking the NYX Professional Sweet Cheeks. And this one's in the shade Baby Doll, which I thought would match the, like, smoky eye, you know? Just a smidge, little, tiny little baby dot on my nose. Oh. Yeah, look at that color. I think I'm, I probably could have even used this as like a base. You know what I mean? Uh, like an eyeshadow base. Okay. So I'm going to be taking the e.l.f. Camo Concealer. Um, this is just the original in the shade Fair Beige. Oof. Actually, I think this one might be like expiring. Okay, now I'm going to take some of the Ciate London Everyday Vacay Powder. This this powder is like very stark white, so I don't use it often, but I mean, it's a nice powder. So for my bronzer, I'm going to be taking the Iconic... Oh, no. 
Okay, so I literally just kind of ghetto repressed it. This is not going to last long, I could tell. Oof. Oh, yep. Mm -hmm. This is going to be not great. <laughs> so because it's not pressed as well as it originally was pressed, it's going to be very kick up -y and like extra pigmented. <laughs> not bad for a ghetto repress, let me tell ya. All right, and then for my blush today, I'm going to be taking the Unearthly Cosmetics. Um, this is the, this is part of their sleepover collection. This is in the shade Cherub, which is just this beautiful, beautiful, like bright baby pink. So now for the fun part, let's go into the highlighter. So this does have three different shades. We have Starstruck, which looks blue. Blind in, which looks green, and are you kidding me? Which looks kind of like greeny gold. Okay, this is my first time touching these. All right, we have Starstruck, Blind in, and are you kidding me? Ooh, there it is. So you can kind of see the blue, the green, and this one's like, I don't know, that one kind of looks like champagne-y green, maybe? Let's start with Are You Kidding Me? Because I want to I wanna get that one on my face. Oop, I picked up a ton on this brush. Okay. Light dips, light dips. Oh, Michaela Glamline, are you kidding me? That was a shade I took. Good one. Holy fuck balls. Okay, so I put the shade Blind In on here, which is a very greeny shade. I think I like this one a little bit more because it has that gold. So I'm going to take some of this on this side. Make sure that my tones are matching and also equally blinding. And I'll take some of the shade Blind In. On this side, again, just to make the tones match. Jesus Christ. If you are scared of highlighter, this one is not for you. Let me tell ya. Oh my God. Yes. Yes. Mm, mm, mm. So for under my eyes, I'm gonna do the same. Actually, I think I'm gonna take just a little bit of all these neon colors. Let's try that. Starting with shade power charged pulse energy chemistry So I'm going to take some of my NYX Jumbo White Pencil. This is the shade Milk. And apply that right in the inner. I'm going to do a little inner corner doo doo doo. And then I'm going to take these Beauty Creation Lashes. These are in the style She's a Tease. So these are very, very... They're very long, but they're thin. Like, they're very flared out into a way that you'll be able to see the detail through them. So, I'm going to go ahead and apply these. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to opt for, like, a nude lip. And then we can come back and see the completed look. Jesus Christ, look at that. <laughs> a woman after my own heart, let me tell you. Okay, so here's the completed look. I just went ahead and finished everything up. Did this eye, threw in the lashes, my lip combo, which I think this lip is so pretty. <sighs> I feel like I went with that very like dusty rose tone today like for like my blush and my eyes and my lips and I love it so much like it's so pretty. Um, so I went in with the LA Girl Lip Liner in the shade Blushing and then the NYX um, Butter Gloss in the shade Tiramisu which is essentially the same as this lip liner. So I'm really really happy about that. Um, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. That's how I feel. So yeah. Um, so 
these are the vibes. I really hope that you guys enjoyed today's tutorial. Definitely um, don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below of any other looks that you want to see. That is going to conclude today's video. Um, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you like me and if you like my content. And without further ado, we're going to go right on ahead. Roll the clip.